Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back. And it's understandable. A lot of you guys have been asking about uh, VPN deals that are available in the UK. And, you know, that's understandable why you would ask that, because some deals are uh, region locked at times. But today I do have uh, links. If you click any of the links below, by the way, be it the Express, Nord or Surfshark uh, link, you'll be able to get that deal regardless of your location. Um, you know, Nord, Surfshark and ExpressVPN don't really tend to make any region locked deals. When they do offer a deal, it's usually for everybody. And if you click in the, the link in the description below, you'll be able to get yourself uh, these deals, which, uh, you know, you've got 15 months. Uh, essentially, you're getting three months for free with ExpressVPN. Uh, you'll be getting an extra month with the link uh, below with um, the NordVPN deal here. Usually they give three months for free, but you'll be getting four um, for the two year plan and four extra months over over the uh, two years already uh, and you've got the two year plan here for the price of one with uh, Surfshark. So, of course, you know, if you're interested in any of these, be sure to check the link in the description below for each one of these deals. You'll be able to grab them right away. And if you'd like to also learn more about these VPNs, uh, I'll leave full reviews, full in-depth reviews. I'll give you more of an in-depth look into the privacy policy, speed streaming and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features. If you guys are interested in kind of learning more about these VPNs before making a subscription. And if you do, let's say, um, perhaps get Surfshark or Nord and then decide to get ExpressVPN, uh, you'll be able to do so because all of their plans have a 30 day money back guarantee. So, you know, there's no worries there. And you've got also, you know, as you can tell, there are money back guarantees on all of the plans. No risk here, really. You can just try out a month. And if you don't like the service, you can get yourself a refund through the uh, live chat support, which you'll find on the main website, just at the bottom right here. Uh, so yeah, usually it's here at the bottom right. So you can just click here and uh, get uh, ask for your refund through the live chat support. So as you can tell, 30 day money back guarantee, 30 day money back guarantee, 30 day money back guarantee. So no uh, risk here. And of course, uh, with regards to uh, Surfshark, by the way, I think it's the only one that doesn't uh, offer a 30 day money back guarantee unless you go for the um, two year plan. So yeah, keep that in mind uh, if you're going to just try it out for a month. But if you wanted to try out Surfshark, you can definitely try it out on, um, uh, you can get a seven day trial on a mobile device. Granted, you just download uh, Surfshark from the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store. Uh, you'll be able to grab yourself a seven day free trial. And it's the same with uh, ExpressVPN, by the way. Uh, you won't be able to get a free trial with Nord, but a full trial, a full seven day free trial, you'll be able to get it on your mobile device with ExpressVPN and Surfshark if you guys are interested. Um, so, you know, how do you know which to choose? You know, maybe you don't want to watch the reviews and you're just like, hey, just give me a quick conclusion. I want to get the best. If you're looking for the best, uh, ExpressVPN will be the one. So with regards to streaming services or Netflix, using it as a reference, using Netflix as a reference, ExpressVPN is able to unblock up to 18 Netflix libraries, uh, 10 with Nord and 15 with Surfshark. ExpressVPN is, uh, covers the biggest number of regions at 94 countries, 60 with uh, Nord and 65 with Surfshark. So, you know, of course, with regards to security, encryption, no logs policy, ExpressVPN is just at the top. It's what I usually use. And, you know, if you're looking for a VPN that gets you to spend as little time fiddling with it as possible, just, you know, no complications here. Go to your options, pick lightweight UDP protocol. Here's the uh, kill switch. Here's the split tunneling. That's it. It's as simple as that. Now pick your server and go ahead and uh, turn it on, you know, whereas with uh, NordVPN, you'll be getting a few extra options here and there, such as specialty servers, you get the powerful NordLynx protocol, you have an ad blocker, uh, an internet kill switch, which is, uh, of course, the kill switch and split, split tunneling are available across all three VPNs, but here you get an extra uh, feature called the app kill switch, of course, you get split tunneling, 
custom DNS and obfuscated servers if you're in a censorship heavy country. Obfuscation is always on by default, by the way, with ExpressVPN. Remember what I said about ease of ease of use and accessibility. You know, it gets you to spend as little time turning on and off or toggling options here and there. So just all you need to do is download it and turn it on, which is why I use ExpressVPN. Uh, but it only allows you to secure up to five devices per subscription. If you're looking to secure one more, you'll get six with Nord and a whole bunch of options, as I explained. But if you're looking for the VPN that gets you uh, to spend as little as possible while getting the job done still, and you're not really sacrificing much on security and features, you still get multi-hop and static IP, which are dedicated um, IP and double VPN, which are also available in NordVPN, by the way. You just have to switch to OpenVPN um, and you'll be able to access them here, dedicated IP and double, uh, and double VPN, which will write your connection through two servers rather than one for extra security. Um, what else you're going to be getting with uh, Surfshark? Of course, you'll be getting your whitelister, which is split tunneling, uh, the ad blocker, and the kill switch, and of course uh, the powerful WireGuard protocol, protocol, and the Shadow Socks protocol, which will uh, help you reach banned websites if you're in a censorship. Um, if you're, if some, let's say you're in China and you're trying to access Facebook but it's not working, um, you also have no borders mode, which will allow you to uh, bypass a censorship firewall such as the Great Firewall of China. Uh, but then again, the cool thing about ExpressVPN is you don't have to do any of that to make uh, to make it work. Just download the application and turn it on and you're good to go. Uh, the only thing you might want to turn on is the kill switch if you're in a censorship heavy country, just to make sure nothing leaks if your VPN disconnects unexpectedly. And split tunneling is very intuitive and super easy to use. You can just you know add whatever you, you're looking for here, whether you want to uh, have an application bypass or use the VPN tunnel. I don't usually use it that much unless I'm, you know, maybe trying to download uh, something using a torrent or perhaps I just want to unblock a Netflix library without having uh, the rest of my network affected by uh, the VPN. So again, if you guys are interested in learning more about these VPNs, you'll find links to reviews down in the description below. And again, all of these VPNs, the deals that I uh, showed you at the beginning of the video are all going to be available, of course, whether you're in the UK or outside the UK. So no worries there. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a wonderful day.